you know, given this eight limb path, you know, what does that look like for Deepak every day? What's a daily practice for you? Is it asana? Is it meditation? Is it both? Is it, you know, um, do you roll out a yoga mat and do postures or, you know, what, what does that look like for you personally? So I start at six o'clock in the morning. I roll out a yoga mat, but first I do about maybe half an hour of uh, meditation. Then I do another half hour of uh, uh, breathing pranayam. And then I do a full hour of asana in the morning. That's So that's a full two hours. And then in the evening before I sleep, I do another hour of meditation, but no yoga. Wonderful. So my is practice is all together about three hours a day, which is fine because, you know, I'm, I'm, I work only from 11 to 5 usually, and I don't work on weekends, so, but I'm flexible. I can change that too. Beautiful. And do you practice on your own or do you have a sequence that you follow as far as the I asana goes? follow the uh, sequence. Actually, the sequence in the book is about 50 postures, so I follow that. And then I have another teacher in New York who has a studio also close to my house. And I periodically visit him just to do prana, just to do, uh, you know, one hour of breathing uh, practices. Uh, and, you know, I find them very profound. So three hours of, you know, meditation and yoga every day. And then uh, once in a while, I go to a different studio, teach another teacher uh, to practice breathing exercises, uh, prana. Wonderful. That's that's uh, very dedicated. I love the commitment to the practice and these all these practices. Yeah, I don't do it for an outcome. I just do it because it's fun. Yeah. <laughs> so sweet. 